Hey, what's up, YouTube? HBIC or Vexicus4666. How's it going, Phil? It's time. Konami, aka Shonen Jump Alpha, needs your help again to pick the next Yu Gi Oh! promo card. Now, unfortunately, it's not for Europe and like Australia and all that stuff, which stinks. Cause I know my friend Alentio is not happy with this, but there's nothing I can do about that. So, let's look at the cards that we get to pick from this time around. Now, I will butcher these names. You guys already know that. The Wicked... What the fuck is this thing? Wicked... A cold... Whatever. This Wicked Monster is a Reptile Effect Dark Level 8. 2500 attack, 0 defense. If you have 5 or more cards in your hand, you can normal summon this card without tribute. When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the grave, you can supposed to summon this card in defense position. And it's treated as a tuner. Hmm, not bad. You can only use this effect of uh, this card once per turn. It's not that hard having five cards in your hand. Just think if you just open, you go second, you open this card, you got six cards, boom. Next is number S0, Utopia Zexel. Utopic, whatever. Warrior Exceed Effect Light. Question mark, undetermined attack and defense point. Take three number exceeds monsters with the same rank. This card's original rank is always treated as one. You can also exceed some of this card by discarding one rank of magic, then use a Utopia Exceeds monster as the Exceeds material. Exceeds material attached to that monster. Okay, becomes it. This card exceeds some, it cannot be negated. When this card is exceeds some, your opponent cannot activate card or effects. This card gains 1000 attack per. Attack and defense for each exceed material attached to it. Once per turn, during your opponent's turn, you can detach one exceed material from this card. Your opponent cannot activate cards or effects this turn. This is a quick effect. Okay, people, right as of right now, vote for this. I like it. Next is Perform Pal Trump Panda. Beast Pendulum Effect, Earth Level 3, Pendulum Scale 3, 800 attack, 800 defense. When your opponent, no, what am I reading? I'm reading ahead of myself. When your pendulum monster is targeted for an attack, you can negate the attack. You can only use the effect of this card once per turn. When you pendulum summon, no, when your pendulum monster is targeted for an attack, you can negate the attack. You can only use the effect of this card once per turn. Once per turn, you can increase this pendulum scale by one. Eh, yuck. Relink Karibo. Fiend effect dark level one three hundred attack two hundred defense. If this card is tributed, draw one card. If your monsters would be destroyed by battle, you can banish this card from your graveyard instead. If yes. it's okay, it's like one of those guy for that black luster deck. Number ninety three Utopia Kaiser Warrior Exceed effect level twelve. 2500 attack, 2000 defense. Two or more exceeds exceed material with the same rank that has exceeds material. Once per turn, you can summon rank 9 or lower. I remember this card now. I've seen this on Dub Pro. You can special summon rank 9 or lower number monsters with 3000 or less attack that has different ranks from each other from your extra deck up to the number of different exceeds material attached to this card, but their effects are negated. Then, each other from your extra deck to the number of different exceed materials has to this card, but their effects are negated. Then I lost my spot. Fuck. Then detach one exceed material from this card. For the rest of this turn, any battle damage your opponent takes is half. Also, you cannot special summon while you control other number exceed monsters. This card cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects. I like two cards that I need you guys to vote for. Number S Utopia Zexel or number 93 Utopia Kaiser. I'm probably going to vote on multiple different accounts. But, uh, I like it. But, tell me in the comments below what you guys will pick. And I'll see you guys next video. Catch me if you can.